We've reviewed a secret twin wallet. We're revisiting it today to give you five reasons why you should not buy it. Wallets are so 2017. But you still need them. I've tried to appify a lot of my cards in my wallet with useful apps, and it works, but there's certain cards you still need, like your driving license, your ID card, your public transport card, and cash. So for us, our wallet of choice is the Secret Wallet. Secret got the Red Dot Award for its sexy design. But the Twin Wallet is a fat wallet. That's the reason I got the mini wallet. It's pretty much half the size and gives you the same functionality. Less cards, that's all. So if you're looking for something more compact or small, I'd suggest look for something else in the collection apart from the twin wallet. And even though this is a thick wallet, the problem with all secret wallets is there's not so much room for cash. So what you end up doing is just storing cards. It does have a flip out section in which you can store a few notes, a couple of coins, but that's it. So if you're somebody who uses cash a lot, or in a country that uses cash a lot, we wouldn't recommend the secret twin wallet. Come to think of it, we wouldn't recommend any of the secret wallets because they're primarily made for cards. We're not sure how secret did their market research. Twin wallet is the most expensive from the collection, and Dutch people aren't known to be spending a lot. So maybe you might want to select something else which is less expensive. For the latest prices, check out the links in the description below. So we've all worn pants at some point in our life. And the thing is, we also stick our wallets into the back pockets of those pants. It's quite common. But I would not recommend that with the secret twin wallet. So those are five reasons not to buy the secret twin wallet. Thank you so much for watching. You've been awesome. And we've been DHRME.